Hello, hello, hello. Let me know if you can hear me. I have replenished the magical blind box. We're not gonna open all of these today. I also have a box of blind bags that I couldn't line up here. And at some point we're gonna throw in some random gotchas too, cause I love those personally. And maybe we'll alternate blind box, blind bag and see what we have. I'm so happy with this wall. It looks so good. I got a lot of remits that I wanted to open. I haven't been opening a lot of the Ken Elephant blind boxes and they've been doing gotchas too with the same stuff, but I think the blind boxes look so good. I found Totoro and Domo-kun. I thought it's even called Nostalgic Domo. Look at, they're so cute. So Domo-kun is the mascot of NHK, which is like a TV channel, TV network. He's from my childhood. I personally want to dive into all the anime stuff because that's what I'm obsessed with right now, but... What? Is this like an actual plate? It's a circle. Oh, it might be metal. Let's open this. I got this yesterday at the supermarket. A little Mofusan box. Any movement is going to shake the wall. This is a... It's called Circle Multi Tray. So I think it's just a little plate, but there are eight designs. It's by Heart, who also does DIY candies. Oh, interesting. It's like a little tin tray. Are you ready? Oh, that's adorable. It almost looks like an ashtray. That's funny. We can put, oh my goodness, you know what we can do is we can use it for like the little remint pieces that we open. We can keep them on here. And it comes with a little piece of gum, which, meh. We did have someone say Sailor Moon Cat, so why don't we take one of these? So we did the One Piece Cats. I did a full set unboxing of those. And then yesterday at my hobby store, I found the Sailor Moon Cats. Personally, I just want Mercury. Mercury's my favorite. Sailor Moon or Tuxedo Mask would be okay too. Let me destroy the box. And we have Venus! I know I just literally just said I don't want a full box, but these are cute. Look at that! Oh what my goodness, it's adorable. Oh, now I want more. This always happens. We'll put you on the tray there. This is my current obsession. I am obsessed with free ren right now, and it feels weird when I say it like that. I'm used to saying free ren. Free ren, is that right? It sounds so weird. Free ren. And they had art boards. Now, I've never been an art board collector, but there are 10 different designs, and they're actually pretty good odds of getting free ren. There's free ren A, B, Fern, Stark, Himmel, Himmeru. Uh, there's Aizen and Haita. Feels weird saying them in English. And then group, group, a chibi free run, and then teaser design. I don't know what teaser design means, but let's open this up. That is such an unsatisfying way to open it. They're clear! Wait! I love these even more now. I got a, um, Spy Family one that was a clear plastic and I love these so much more than the paper ones. I got Stark, which is not exciting. I mean, it looks good. Look at that. I need that free run one. I'm gonna need my scissors for this one. But this is the Sanrio character's secret mascot. They're all little babies and they're on rocking horses. Obviously, we want Kuromi. That's all that we ever want. We do not want Hangyodon. Also, Village Vanguard tapes up their blind boxes like extra. I don't know if they have problems with people stealing them or what, but I'm gonna need scissors for this. Okay, let's open this up. I think I got it cut enough. I see yellow. No, Hangyodon's yellow. Pumpum pudding is also yellow. It's a 50-50, guys. Oh, it's pom pom pudding. Okay, not the one I wanted, but that was instant relief. Look at that, it's very cute. I thought it was gonna be smaller, so I was like 990 yen, but justified. It's a little bit smaller than, say, mini so or like Pop Mart style figures, but it looks cute. The paint job's really, really good. 
Okay, so this is one that I got at the supermarket. It's a chibi, they call it karakuriru, character acrylic. So karakuril, I don't know. Um, I think they're tiny. I think they come in little stands. Not sure, but this is like my current hyperfixation. Funny thing though, I can't decide which character I like the best, but I just really, really like the design of the art. Okay. So, like I said, I don't know who my favorite character is, um, but we either want Akane or Kana. So the kind of greenish blue haired girl or the red haired girl. But the main characters are good too. Like Ai's okay. Aqua I can pass on to a friend, but both me and my friend that like Oshinoko right now, we, po we both keep getting Ruby, which is the blonde haired girl, the long haired girl. Oh, this is actually a decent sized acrylic. Jung. Oh, we got Kana. Oh, these are nice. So these were 390 some yen. So a little bit more pricey, but for a nice acrylic, I accept. I realize I've been having a lot of anime content lately, but it's kind of what's easy to get right now. There's not much new Sanrio stuff out other than gotchas. So I'm always on the hunt. If you see any like fun toy news, please tweet me or send it on Discord because I'm always looking for fun stuff to open. Okay, here's Kana. I like that. I only got one of these. Kana. I really, really like Kana as a character, but I like Akane too. I know I don't have to pick one favorite, but it's easier when you're, you're a merch hoarder, you know? Oh wait, look at all the designs. There's rare ones that have gold foil. Oh, I don't know if I like that the gold foil ones and the normal ones have the same designs, though. I wonder what the chances are to get the rare ones. There's one Memcho. I always get Memcho and Ruby. It says it's a capsule rubber mascot, too, so it must be the second series. We want Toge or Gojo. Those are my favorites from the first series. I don't really care for Nanami, but I know that there's so many fans out there. Get. Oh, he's adorable. I love Toge. And he's talking. You can see his mouth. That's very rare. Oh my goodness. Oh, adorable. How do you guys display your rubber straps if you collect them? I think I'm going to get like a case or shadow box type display frame and stick them all in there by anime. I'm kind of obsessed with magnets right now because I'm trying to fill the fridge at the studio. Oh my goodness. <laughs> They're slowly like inching their way to the edge to fall off. Here are the Kara magnets, as I call them. It looks like, oh, there's 20 different ones in a secret. I was gonna say, if it's the main main characters, I'm gonna know them all, but I'm nowhere close to being caught up on the anime or manga, so I mean, honestly, we want Zoro, Chopper, or Sanji, because I'm basic. Oh, it comes with a note. Wait, is that a spoiler? It says Jinbe. I feel like that's a spoiler. Why would they do that? It is Jinbe. I don't want Jinbe. I'm not even going to open that. Does anyone want Jinbe? It's a thick acrylic. It's pretty good. There's Luffy, Zoro, Nami, Usopp, Sanji, Chopper, Robin, Frankie, Brooke. Okay, so through nine, I'd be okay with those. Then there's Jinbe, Eustace Kid, I don't know who that is, Killer, Law, Law'd be okay, Ding Ding, Kaido, King, Queen, Drake, Hawkins, and then who is this? Apu. I, the name sounds familiar, but I don't know who that is. Yeah, I only really want like one through nine. Makes it a little hard to collect these. Let's do Axolotl. I mean, I don't know if we'll get Axolotl, but we can try. We obviously want the Axolotl. The Dachshund's cute. Lop ear. Loppu I was trying to read the katakana. And then a kitty. I think I've gotten the kitty from a gacha before. It looks really familiar. I think I have a gray cat. Might be a different series. And then a Pomeranian. Warning! This is not food. Don't eat your toys, kids. Oh, I think it's the doggo. It's the, oh, 
gone forever. I actually don't know where it went. This is the Miku Can Badge Collection. Are these the embroidered ones? They are. So these are really popular right now. They're coming out with a second series of the Sanrio ones. And there's some Spy Family ones and I don't know if they're Kirby ones. I want to say there are, but I'm not sure. There are 15. That's a lot. And it looks like there are, are they all Snow Mikus? I think they are actually. I love Snow Miku. Oh yeah, it says Snow Miku up here. Oh, they all have English names. Snow Miku 2010. Snow Miku 2011, Snow Miku 2012. I guess I just have the years on them. Snow Miku 2024. There's so many Snow Mikus. Oh, this is the one I got last year. Snow Miku 2023. Wait, these are big badges. These are so cool. I know they're like 100% machine made, but they look so good. Look at that. So they are badges. I never know what to do with these either. I probably should try to make an Ita bag at some point just for funsies. Gotta decide who my like best Oshi is. So this is a Oki Agari Koboshi, which means they're like the, I always forget what they're called, the little wobbly toys that you can knock over and they stand up again. So we have Chu Totoro, Medium Totoro, Shou Totoro, Tiny Totoro, and Snowman Totoro. These are actually really heavy. Gray Totoro, Green Totoro, Brown Totoro. I was really excited when I found these yesterday because the Ghibli blind boxes, you can usually only get them at the Ghibli store. So let me just destroy the box. Oh, double secret. I see green. I think these were like 660 yen. Not a bad price. Oh, look at, I love Totoro. Kunats! There's 16 different ones. I don't even know what series this is. It's just called Pokemon B. But I saw Sylveon and Pikachu on the package. And those are like the two that I recognize. There's an Eevee on there. Oh, here's, oh, <laughs> spoiler. I think it's um, Rockruff. Oh, I'm so bad with the names. It, Yuanko. I want Sylveon. Here is Rockruff. Look at them all wobble. Today's word of the day is wobble. You know the bath bomb toys? They've started doing like, I'm assuming it's like a bath salt, but they're doing like blind box form now, which is pretty cool. Cause I like that they're separated. But of course there's always Hangildon. Let's do kitchen tools. Cause I've never opened this one. And then we'll, we'll alternate. We'll come back to these. If you like miniatures, these are usually around 500 yen for a box, I would say. Oh my goodness, so I want the blender. And then you have the little cooking trays. And I think these are like real brands because I think that's what Ken Elephant does for the most part. They make miniatures with, they collaborate with companies. They do not have the box opening tech that Reman does, but that's okay. They put all of their budget into a green kettle. Oh my goodness, look how tiny it is. Look at that. Then the lid goes on it. I have, um, there's a rice cooker one that I have. It's, it's very nice too. Look at that. I feel like you could probably actually pour tea out of this or water. It's a kettle. That's so good. Wait, oh, that's like a, a salad spinner, like a lettuce spinner thingy to get all the water off. We need the blender. Definitely need the blender. Oh yeah, and here's all the like brands or companies that they collaborated with. Let's open the clip. I wanted to get a full box of these, but um, my budget manager said I did not need a full set of these and that I could just have a few. So here we are. But they're so cute. There's 14 different clips. These are Bandai too. I swear Bandai is doing good. A lot of the stuff, this was Bandai. This was Bandai. Why does this look like a broccoli like this? These are so good for like journal clips. They're the nice plastic. They don't ruin the paper. Are we ready? I'm going to assume this is upside down. Jam. Why is this the cutest thing I have ever seen in my life? 
How adorable. Look at them. Okay, we're using this when we journal. Don't let me forget. Sorry, budget manager. We're getting more of these. Let's open Nancy next. Let me enhance a little bit more for you. We have, this is the Secret Garden series. Isn't the packaging darling? So this is like OG Nancy with the same pose and like little snot bubble. I was gonna say, I've seen iron artwork, but I don't think I have it. We like Forever Summer. Iron artwork is very pretty. And then the one, Viola. These are all flower names, I think. And then there's a lot of orange and greens, but that's because they're flowers. Lily's pretty. I don't really care for fountain or statue. And then there's two secrets. I always thought this was a stand. Apparently it's just a weight. Purple hair. We got the one on the box. How exciting. How adorable. She has pastel purple hair, sparkles, a little crown. Pansies, it looks like. Oh, she is darling. And look at her little wings. I'm so happy. She's so pretty. I love her. Magnet collection gum. Oh, this is the Sky one. I like Sky stuff. It's simple, usually. And honestly, a lot of repeated art. But they do cute stuff. The clear cards that I collect are from Nsky. I appreciate them making affordable blind bags. I think it's the one on the bag. Ta-da! Okay. These are really nice. It's like a matte, which probably means it's not waterproof. I don't know. Maybe it's sealed. Ooh, it's stinky. These magnets are never really strong. I will say that, but if you're trying to decorate your fridge or like filing cabinet, do people even have filing cabinets anymore? That would be good for that. Also, it's not cut all the way through. I kind of want to just leave it like this for now. I probably will go back and get more of these since these are in the budget. Let's do the retro trunk. I actually have opened a few of these before. I think I have the fresh punch. Did I open Patty and Jimmy? Do any of you remember? I don't know, but we would like My Melody or Tuxedo Sam. Can we talk about the name of these characters? Nyani Nyanyunyanyong. Nyani, say that fast. Nyani Nyunyanyong. My melody. I think there's something in it. I hear I hear noises. It's so like intricate. The handle moves. And oh, never mind, there's nothing in it. There is a mirror though. I think there's a film on that. You can peel off so it looks clear. Look at it, you can store so much in here. I love it. I need to find my other ones. So that's gonna be another stream we need to do. And actually, you know what? Budget manager would probably love that stream because I'm not spending money. I have the Sanrio Pitacotto that came out a little after the Mofusan one. But as you can see on this art, it looks really faded. Like I know that's the design, but this was another reason I didn't buy a box of these either, because why is it so faded? Kuromi? Yeah, there's a Kuromi. Oh, there's a group one there too. There's Wish Me Mel! Okay, I know, we know what we want now. It's a design choice for sure. I think I saw something. Kuromi! Finally! And gum. All the gum. It is faded, but it's not as bad as it looks on the packaging, if that makes sense. Camera, please. That's actually pretty cute. These are also in the budget because they are, uh, are they under 300? They're either 300 something yen or under 300. Aiden actually told me about this set. They had it at my hobby store and I really want maple syrup. Ketchup's really cute too, but I really want maple syrup because he's cooking pancakes. The one where he's in the laundry basket is also very cute. I think it's ketchup. So I've always been a big Disney person. You all know that. But lately Kirby and Snoopy have been really growing on me. Oh, it has a window. This is so cute. Look at that tiny hot dog. Um, that is so adorable. Let me enhance. Um, yes. I like this so much better than the terrarium ones. I like that he's not like trapped under plastic. 
I saw this at the mall yesterday. So it's just called Petite Kian. I thought it'd be cute to maybe put sticker flakes in when I send them to my friends. And they're 10 different designs. I thought the art looked cute. I will say there has been a lot of Spy Family merch out there and it's starting to all look the same. It's the one on the back. We keep getting the ones that are on the packaging. Wait, this is like actually a decent size. It comes with two candies. This is nice. And then there's Chimera on the back. Little Chibi Anya. So I have another one of these, so we'll open it next time, but that's adorable. This is another collab with an actual company. Oh, this is heavy. And uh, not gonna lie, I really want the full set because they did such a good job with this one. Oh, I didn't realize it came with like little shelves and stuff too. I thought it was just like all coffee stuff. It's heavy though, so I feel like it's one of the shelves maybe. I didn't even look at the lineup. Which one is it? Oh, it's big. Oh, it's number one. Oh, latte art to go on the coffee cup. That's really cool. And it comes with slippers. I wonder if these slippers, slippers, slippers will work with my DVDs. Wait, I really like this. I do think this was a little more expensive. No, 935 yen. So on the higher end of remit prices, but not bad because I think this one was like 1,100 yen, 1,200 yen. I can't remember. We have a little mug tree and a mug to go on it. I'm gonna drop something. Coffee beans, a lid. Oh, we have coffee to go, oh, I'm gonna drop that. Coffee to go in the mug, which, you know, I'm just, ah, okay, never mind. The slippers. I actually have slippers that look exactly like this. That is amazing. Thanks so much for hanging out with me. Please leave a thumbs up and a comment on the archive video and the VOD when it goes up. It helps me out a lot and I appreciate you guys and I hope you have a wonderful weekend. Bye-bye!